Delmar Loop Trolley will be up and running again. This morning, the Bi-State Development Board voted to revive the trolley. They talked about a new operating agreement with the taxing district that built the trolley, which stopped running back in December of 2019. The feds had issued a threat to either get the trolley running again or return millions of dollars in grant funding. Future implications of returning the funding was a big motivator to move forward with the revival of this. The only board member to vote against the proposal was Derek Cox, who voiced concerns about staffing shortages already impacting transportation. Cutbacks in service based on um, labor availability is, that's a completely legitimate point, Commissioner Cox. That's absolutely right. But so is our capacity to get federal funding as we move forward. A default as a region, completely legitimate point. The problem is, is that will devastate service for those same customers. Board members talked about the fact that even if the loop trolley is not sustainable, accepting the funding will put the bi-state in a better position for future funding. We are